strength in reverse. All right. You could be dealing with a Leo. <clears throat> someone is not someone is lacking confidence someone's not bossing up someone doesn't have the courage to fight or they're just giving up that's the overall energy what happened in the past someone went that shit crazy you could be dealing with a sagittarius a fixed sign sagittarius but someone just lost their shit they lost their patience they couldn't have it anymore okay they weren't doing this anymore this is someone who's not ready to compromise not ready to cooperate this is someone who just does not want just went completely out of their heads all right coming into the current situation i do see that things are going to come into balance okay that things are getting balanced there's going to be equal to equal give and take or things are getting balanced okay there is someone who's understanding there is someone who's ready to work with you or you're ready to work with someone and you both have an equal balance all right this has been influenced by the three of swords in reverse the good thing is that because someone is healing from a heartbreak okay there could be a third party situation or there could have been a very painful breakup or someone who was going through a breakup all right but someone's coming out of that breakup someone's healing all right they've give you've given someone time they've given you time you've healed and that's why now the balance is going to be there all right what's on your mind is the five of swords you could be dealing with an air sign so this is a lot of mind games someone's playing mind games or you even feel that you need to stand up for yourself you need to fight for yourself okay you need to fight back and uh, this is just standing up for yourself standing up through any mind fuckery or any mind games that anyone's playing you need to put them to place why is all this happening because of the queen of swords in reverse this is because someone's being very very bitter someone cut someone out this is someone who's very vengeful okay someone's pissed off This woman is very bitter and she's really pissed off okay she's angry could be a lot of vengeful this could be an ex i do think this this has to do with an ex because we have a breakup here um but yeah someone cut someone out in anger all right and there was no communication however in the future i see that you will be moving on to a peaceful resolution all right things are going to get better and you're going to move into karma waters now i just need to know if you're moving away from this person or if this person is coming towards you could be traveling all right let's clarify the strength in reverse why is the strength in reverse as the overall energy the scorpio yeah someone lost confidence that's why they stopped talking you have the page of pentacles in reverse could be dealing with a younger earth sign taurus will go capricorn clash for the page of pentacles in reverse yeah someone was feeling very very burdened they were stressed out they had a lot happening in a situation right so that is why <clears throat> so we have the overall energy is someone gave up someone doesn't fight want to fight for anything anymore they don't have the confidence to fight for something anymore that's why they stopped offering their pentacle they stopped giving to this situation because it was becoming a very big burden so someone wanted to relieve a situation bottom of the deck we have the 6 of wands in reverse no forward movement lack of public recognition something was not successful why is the temperance in reverse for the past Yeah, someone who lost patience, they could have loved you a lot. You could be dealing with another water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Emotions were stabilized, but they lost their shit. Probably this is someone who waited for a very long time for you. Clarify for the King of Cups. Yeah. Probably this is someone who was waiting for you to leave a relationship or leave something, okay? And that's when Yeah, so in the past someone lost their shit like I said, right? They just lost all their patience. This could be a water sign. This was someone who you really really loved or this person loved you very very much, but they could have been waiting for a very long time for you to leave a relationship or leave a marriage or leave a committed uh relationship, whatever have you. Try for the 6 of pentacles, please. Try for the 6 of pentacles. What is the 6 of pentacles as the current situation for Scorpio? Mm. So maybe You're focusing on your money right now. Clarify for the King of Pentacles in reverse. Right now I think you're very very focused on your money. I don't think you're in communication with this person. You're very focused on your money. You're focused on your um um You you you're looking see we have the king of pentacles in reverse okay this is someone who's very very self focused okay this is someone who's focusing on their money their property anything tangible okay someone very self focused very self obsessed someone who's completely driven on making themselves better okay they don't really care i think this is someone who's not really giving to love right now this is someone who's very focused on their work and 
there is someone who's been emotionally absolutely cold. So I think it's the king of pentacles in reverse and the queen of cups in reverse, right? This could be one person or this could be two people. But according to me, this is one person. This is you probably shut off to love. You're working on yourself. You're giving yourself all the focus. You're working on your money. You don't have time for love. And you're emotionally unavailable. You're shut. You're cold. You're not giving to this person anymore. Clarify the three of swords in reverse. Three of swords in reverse. What is this healing about? Clarify the three of swords in reverse. Yeah, see, like I said, healing from a breakup. Someone's healing from a breakup. This could have been a very strong soulmate connection. They have the two of cups. This was a very, very strong soulmate. Is a very strong soulmate connection. Okay, is. I'm not even saying it's a, uh, it's, it's not there anymore. You guys met eye to eye. You guys were on the same page. You guys loved each other a lot. But there could have been a lot of stress. Could be a third party involved. Doesn't have to be. But that's a lot of stress. Someone's coming out of that breakup. Someone's healing from that breakup. Why for the five of swords? Why is the five of swords on Scorpio's mind? Why is the five of swords on Scorpio's mind? Yeah. You think you need to stand up for yourself because someone's not communicating with you or you're just emotionally shut off. You know what? Okay, one more time. Clarify the page of cups and rivers. Let me clarify this one more time. Clarify the page of cups and rivers. Yeah. So... <clears throat> Maybe there was a lot of mind games. Someone is playing a lot of mind games. This is someone who wants to win under any cause. So this is someone who just likes to self-sabotage relationships, okay? Maybe you did this. Maybe someone else did this. And now you're emotionally shut off. You get a real picture, okay? You're not into that fantasy world anymore, okay? And maybe someone has a realization that they don't want to do this lovey-dovey. They don't want to live in the fairy tale anymore. They've stopped communicating. Stop those lovey-dovey messages. They've stopped flirting. They've just stopped talking, communicating. It could be because they do, they want to be out of conflict, okay? They want to release this tension or they just don't want to fight for this anymore. Clarify for the five of wands. Let me clarify for this. Why is the five of wands in reverse here? Yeah. They don't want to fight for this anymore, okay? Because there are a lot of secrets. A lot of things are hidden. This is someone who's suppressing their deep emotions. Someone's come... I, yeah. So according to me, I think this is someone who does not want to fight for this anymore, okay? Because I think there's a lot of mind fuckery going on, a lot of mind games going on. They just don't know what's happening. This could be someone who's just very deceptive. Someone feels someone's being very deceptive. That's why they're shut down. And now they don't want to fight for this anymore. Could have been a lot of competition. Could have been a lot of fighting between you both. Maybe you both had to do a lot of fighting to reach to a situation. But yeah, things are hidden. The emotions are suppressed. All right. So, yeah. Emotions suppressed big time. This is someone who's just not hiding, not talking. Someone thinks that there's all that is, there, there are a lot of secrets involved, you know. Try for the Queen of Swords in reverse. Why is the Queen of Swords in reverse here? Try for the Queen of Wands. Try for the Queen of Wands. Try for the Queen of Wands. Okay, so someone cut someone off, could be the person who cut you off, right? Could be an air sign or you cut off an air sign because, because of the queen of wands. That could be a third party situation, like I said, right? So someone cut off someone, either who they were very, very passionate about and they really, really were very attracted to this person, but they think it was, a, it, it was going to be a disaster. So they just thought it's best best to cut off this connection and avoid a disaster rather than face it. So I think someone cut some of them off because they don't want to take action. They're very passionate about this person, but they cut them off because they're trying to avoid the disaster. Why for the tower in reverse? Why for the tower in reverse? What is this tower they're trying to avoid? What is this tower in reverse? What is the tower in reverse? Yeah, see, that's why things aren't moving forward because someone just cut someone off. Whoever they cut, they were very, very passionate about this person. They looked at this person with a lot of passion and love. But they don't, but they want to avoid a disaster from happening. They think things will just be like, things will just come crashing down. And that's why there's no forward movement. Or maybe they just saw this wasn't moving forward. All right, let's clarify the Six of Swords. What is the Six of Swords? What is the Six of Swords, please? Yeah, someone's moving forward. They're not stressed about this anymore as much as they were earlier. We have the Nine of Swords in reverse. Why the Nine of Swords in reverse? 
Yeah. Someone wants to return. <laughs> Clap for the seven of swords in reverse. This is someone who was trying to avoid the entire situation earlier, but now they're moving forward. Clap for the seven of swords in reverse, please. Clap for the seven of swords in reverse. Clap for the seven of swords in reverse. Please clap for the seven of swords in reverse. Hmm. So, what you will be experiencing in the near future is someone's going to move into, someone wants to move into Kama waters. But this is someone who's, but they're not even stressing so much about it, okay? This is someone who wants to return back. Someone who's feeling guilty, maybe because they lost their shit in the past, right? They're feeling guilty that they shouldn't have been so impatient. They're moving towards you. They, they want to return back. If they were avoiding you or they were ignoring you, they're moving towards you again. This could be someone who, who feels they have a loss of control. Could be a control freak. Could be someone who just doesn't, who felt there was, they, they, they lost control of the situation. This is someone very, very stubborn at the same time too. But I feel this is someone who doesn't want to change their ways, right? Whoever you're dealing with could be the Emperor in reverse and Aries. Or this is just someone who's plain very, very stubborn about their ways. My way or the highway kind, you know, but they're returning to you. It's more like the return of the Emperor. Yeah. Bottom of the deck, we have the Ten of Swords in reverse, okay? The worst is done, the worst is over. This is someone who's trying to have like an upheaval, okay? This is someone who's trying to build from scratch with you. They're trying to recover from the pain, okay? There was a painful ending between you guys. There was a there was an ending to a painful cycle. This was a painful breakup, but now someone wants to come back. Yep, 100% someone wants to come back and they're going to communicate with you. This is some exciting communication coming in, right? Someone's coming back, guys. The emperor's returning. All right. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please leave, uh, please leave your comments below and like, share, follow, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.